guys, so before I let you watch the entire of this video, I just wanted to let you know that the clips that I'm that I put here and the video itself is from about a month ago. It's the middle of October. I know these clips have been filmed later in September. Um, I just finally got the time to edit it, so that's why I'm uploading it so late. It's almost a month later and I'm very much still in my accommodation and everything. Um, it's going great, but I still wanted to publish this video and have it as a memoir of some sort. Um, but yeah, just wanted to pop in and let you know that. Enjoy! Hi everyone! Welcome to another video with me. Perhaps this is the last video in my room for a while because, as you may or may not know, I am moving to London tomorrow. It sounds so surreal, yet at the same time all of my stuff is packed away in those boxes or in my suitcase, my carry-on and I already said most of my goodbyes to my friends and family. On one hand I do feel like I am in fact leaving Poland, but on the other hand it seems just like another afternoon in my room spent doing productive tasks and talking to my parents and being present here. Anyways, I don't want to get too philosophical about it. I just wanted to make this intro whilst I still have time to do it and I'm not in a rush, stress and hurry, which I will for sure experience tomorrow. I will try to record some clips here and then tomorrow, but we'll see how that goes. And yeah, this is my moving out and my moving in vlog, I guess. Um, so yeah, I'll just take you with me on my... I wanted to say a little adventure, but I guess this is an understatement on my huge adventure, on the biggest adventure of my life. And I'm gonna record it all, <laughs> somehow capture it on camera. And later on when I'm, you know, far into the future and I'm already working somewhere fancy and pff, we'll see, I will look back on upon it and smile and think that those problems or worries that I'm experiencing right now will probably cease to matter in a matter of weeks, months, and I will surely settle in <laughs> at some point there but the moving process will be stressful for me. I have been rambling for far too long and yeah, I hope you enjoy the vlog. The next day. I've had like four hours of sleep. Actually no, three hours of sleep and I'm not ready, <laughs> but I have to because my box is already out and I need to be out too. What a metaphor. After packing, I spent the remainings of the last morning in my room simply taking everything in, smelling the roses and remembering the view from my window. I was doing fine until I had to say goodbye to my dogs. I must say, it felt weird to be at an airport in times of the ongoing pandemic. I wouldn't say it was deserted, but you definitely could have noticed the difference in the so-called vibe. There are multiple remindings to wear a mask and keep the minimum social distance. Finally, after going through security and passport checks, we were ready to departure and I had my last glance at Poland. I knew I wouldn't be coming home for a while, but that thought didn't stop me from the excitement I felt upon my arrival in London. I'd like to welcome you to London. The local time is 3 minutes to 5 p.m. and the temperature is 17 degrees.
and here you can see the first clip from what is now my new room. I had to get myself equipped with multiple kitchen essentials, as well as some cleaning supplies. And what better place to do so than the cheapest possible option, which is little. So this is how my room looks right now. I just put all the stuff here. Sorry for the mask. I put all my stuff just on the display and I'm gonna unpack it today, which you'll probably see. And now we're just gonna eat some dinner. The last dinner with my parents here. And then I'll come back and show you around. I'm really, really excited. If you can tell, but I'm trying to maintain a serious face right now, but I'm really excited. I feel like Robbie Gilmore right now, if you've watched Gilmore Girls. In the afternoon, we went to this random Korean store and later on enjoyed a dinner at Chinatown. Hi everyone! So, I think this will have to do as my... Um, filming spot right now. So, welcome to my accommodation room where I'll be living for the next year. Uh, right now it looks like a mess but what's going to follow is a time lapse of me unpacking basically because I have so much stuff. I have those three huge boxes sent from Poland. Um, I also have my giant suitcase, my small suitcase, my shopping bags and it's all over the place. I also need to do my bed because it doesn't have anything on it. Um, it's also exciting, but I have to do it now because in the evening I think we're gonna, I mean, I'm gonna meet some people from my hole. I'm nervous, but I'm also excited. I guess it should have been expected. So, shall we begin unpacking? What a fucking mess <laughs> this is. But I promise you it's getting more and more organized. Like, look at this. <laughs> it looks like I'm in front of a teaching board in a classroom, but it's just, there's just this board and I don't know what to do with it. I would say I'm more or less unpacked. It's all looking like a mess, like a hot mess right now and everything's on display I've spent like one and a half hour doing this and I deserve to rest right now um, I also have tomorrow before I start my induction week so I can still go to the stores and buy some stuff that I need like storage boxes or hangers but right now I'm just gonna show you around more or less what's happening, what's the situation situation, what's the situation like okay so that's me. When you walk in, you have my boxes. These are empty and I need to get rid of them tomorrow. These are the my clothes. I didn't find their place. Here's my door. Some of my clothes. The, mm, yeah, this is a mess. These drawers are also a mess. These are just some of my shoes. Don't worry. This is my extension cord. These stuff, I think I need to move them down to the kitchen because I also have my cupboard there, fortunately. Sorry, the floor is just making noises. This is the sink that I've got. <laughs> It has this weird leg thing. My desk. I filled all the drawers with various stuff. Here's the food um, shopping I did to do today. Here's some of my toiletries, books. This is a new water bottle I got. These are some like Polaroids from back home that I need to hang. Look at them. These are my friends and I miss them all. And that's my bed. Oh, and I'm, let me show you um, the view from my window. I guess you can see something. I really like it actually. And also what's so nice is that I live in central London, literally the center of London, but I live like next to my campus, so that's great. And yeah, it's just so surreal that this is going to be my room for the next year. I'm just gonna send my friends some text messages and also my parents, tell them that I'm unpacked and maybe socialize a bit. Who knows? Who knew I could do all of that in one day? Not me. It's the next day, probably saw some videos uh, from the night before 
I met some people yesterday, actually a lot of people, everyone was really nice. Anyways, um, when I came back to my room, it was like 1am and I thought it would be a good idea to open all of my kitchen stuff that I showed you before. You know, just open them, like put them out of their plastic wrappers and get them to the kitchen. So I started doing that and ended up injuring myself pretty badly. Well, I mean, it wasn't just a shallow cut, let's say it was deeper, but it looks bad. So I got dressed up and now I'm gonna meet my parents for the goodbye breakfast. And also, um, dad's a doctor, so he's gonna take a look at whatever this is. Anyways, um, I'm enjoying the life here despite this. And I unpacked my kitchen and I'm gonna show it to you now and then I'm gonna go. Okay, so really quickly, this is my kitchen. This is like the dining area. I mean, you can see everything I don't need to show you. And this is my cupboard <laughs> that I put all of my food essentials. Well, not essentials, but like the cupboard stuff, I guess. And that's pretty much it. And now ah! <laughs> I'm just gonna go down to see my parents, as I said. For some reason i have those irrational fears that like i won't be able to get my head around online teaching at uni because i did online teaching for like a month but it was my old high school so i knew everyone i could ask everyone and it was very simple but it's freaking university and there's just so many things i don't understand yet but i guess i'm just gonna figure everything out as i go I just took a shower, as you can see. It's been a very eventful day. I just took the night off, let's say. Like, I didn't socialize that much in the evening because I just needed to take care of my body today. You know that zen shit. We're doing it today. I'm even gonna drink some mint green tea. And I also think I will end the vlog here because it was supposed to be a move-in vlog, let's say. I know I didn't vlog that much um, and I'm sorry for that and I'm gonna try to do my best when I vlog my yeah, like uni, weekly vlogs, whatever. But yeah, let me know if you enjoyed it and I'll see you in another one. Bye! <laughs>